Hello everybody and welcome to Connor Sports Talk. So today I'm going to be doing my final season predictions for the NFL season of 2017-18. And for reference, uh, this is hours before the Patriots and, and Chiefs game. So let's start with the AFC. Starting with the AFC North. I'm, I'm having the Steelers at 12-4. and four. I did have them at 11-5. I'm just going over what I had them prediction, predicted as before by the week of uh, preseason, preseason week one. So Bengals, I had them at eight and eight. I had them at nine and seven. Ravens, eight and eight. I had them at seven and nine. And then Browns, 13 and three, which is staying the same. Then AFC South, Titans at 10 and six, which is the same. Texans at nine and seven. I had them at eight and eight. Colts at seven and nine. Had them at nine and seven. Jags six and ten, staying the same. Moving on to the AFC East, Patriots at, thir at thirteen and three. I had them at twelve and four. Dolphins at seven and nine. I, I had them at eight before. Bills at two and fourteen. I did have them at four and twelve. Not really high on the Bills whatsoever. Jets at 1-15, staying the same. AFC West, Raiders, 12-4. I did have them at 11-5. Chief, then Chiefs at 10-6, I had them at 12-4. Broncos at 9-7, I had them at 10-6. And, and Chargers staying the same at 9-7. So I'm doing the, then I'm going through the standings of the AFC. The first seed Pats at 13 and 3, second seed Steelers at 12 and 4, third seed Raiders at 12 and 4, fourth seed Titans at 10 and 6, fifth seed Chiefs at 10 and 6, Broncos sixth seed at 9 and 7, Texans uh, seventh seed at 9 and 7, eighth seed Chargers 9 and 7. Ninth seed Bengals, eight and eight. Tenth seed Ravens, eight and eight. Eleventh seed Dolphins, seven and nine. Twelfth seed Colts, seven and nine. Thir thirteenth seed Jaguars at six and ten. Fourth, fourteenth seed Browns at three and thirteen. Fifteenth seed Bills, two and fourteen. And sixteenth seed Jets at. 1-15 so honestly who do I think the best team is I honestly think that the best team are the Raiders but they're just in a tougher division I'm not as high on the Patriots as most people are I mean I'm still very high on them I'm telling you right now how them going to the Super Bowl but the thing is like there's so much talent they're just bound to disappoint, in my opinion. Uh, the only reason why I don't have the Raiders going to the Super Bowl is because of the lack of experience. And the Patriots have plenty of that. Especially winning experience. Moving on to the NFC. Starting again with the NFC North. Packers at 12-4, and four, which is staying the same. Vikings at nine and seven staying the same lions at seven and nine staying the same bears at 13 and three staying the same moving on to the nfc south falcons at 12 and four was 11 and five saints at 10 and six staying the same that could be biased because i am a saints fan bucks at nine and seven staying the same panthers at eight and eight staying the same nfc east Giants 11, 11 and 5 staying the same. Cowboys 10 and 6 staying the same. That's even with the suspension of Ezekiel Elliott. They have Alfred Morris. He's a really good running back, in my opinion. I mean, not really good. He's above average. He had a really good rookie season and sophomore season. Uh, but he kind of bombed him out. He never dropped below 1,000 yards, I believe. He might have had a ninth. 100 uh, rushing yards one year with the Redskins and I don't remember what he had for the Cowboys last year 
I'm not kind of, when I say never had a thousand yards, never didn't have a thousand yards, I'm not counting the Cowboys because he wants his starter off this week. Uh, and then Eagles and an eight, I had them at seven and nine before. Redskins, five and 11, staying the same. I'm not high on the Redskins whatsoever. Sorry. And then uh, NFC West, Seahawks, 10 and six, staying the same. Cardinals, eight and eight, I did have them at seven and nine before. Rams, four and 12, I had them at 13 and, th I mean, three and 13. 49ers, three and 13, had them at four and 12 before. Uh, I just swapped wins between the Rams and the 49ers. I originally had the 49ers sweeping the uh, Rams, but the Rams have more talent. I mean, they uh, added more talent with Sammy Walkins, and I just feel like their offense is going to be a little bit better. So uh, I had them splitting. They're, neither of them are good teams, but 49ers are up and coming. They just need something on offense, really. I feel like they're going to have one of the better defenses. Probably about a, definitely in the top 16 in my opinion. Just based on the fact that the front seven is so good. So overall for the NFC. First seed Falcons at 12-4. Second seed Packers at 12-4. Giants third seed 11-5. Fourth seed Seahawks 10-6. Fifth seed Saints 10-6. Six. Sixth seed Cowboys 10-6. Six. Bucks seventh seed. 9-7, 8th seed Vikings, 9-7, Ninth seed Panthers at 8-8, eight and 10th eight. seed Eagles at 8-8, eight, 11th at eight eight. seed Cardinals at 8-8, eight eight. 12th seed Lions at 7-9, uh, I mean, yeah, 13th seed Redskins at 5-11, 14th seed Rams at 4-12, 15th seed, 49ers at 3 and 13, and 16th seed, thir uh, Bears at 3 and 13. So here's the playoff and Super Bowl predictions. So, that's all for the standings. Pats at first seed, Steelers at second, Raiders at third, Pounds at fourth, Chiefs at fifth, and Broncos at six. So, uh, Six seed versus the third seed, Broncos at Raiders. I have Raiders winning that. And then four, fifth seed at fourth seed, Chiefs at Titans. I have the Titans winning that. Third seed at first seed, Raiders at Patriots. I have the Patriots winning that. And then, then uh, fourth seed at second seed, Steelers at, I mean, uh, Titans at Steelers. I have the Steelers winning that. And then uh, for the championship, Steelers at Pats. I have the Pats winning that. Moving on to the NFC, Falcons first seed, Patriots second. I mean, uh, Packers second seed, Giants third seed, Seahawks fourth seed, Saints fifth seed, and Cowboys sixth seed. So sixth seed at third seed, Cowboys at Giants. I have the Giants winning that. Fifth seed at fourth seed, Saints versus Seahawks. I have the Seahawks winning that. Third seed at first seed, Giants at Falcons. I have the Giants winning that. Uh, fourth seed at at first seed, Seahawks versus Packers. I have the Packers winning that. And then the third seed versus the second seed, Giants at Packers. I have the Packers winning that. So pass versus. Packers in the Super Bowl and have the Packers winning it. And then uh, moving on to the overall standings in the NFL. First seed Pat, uh, Patriots, second seed Falcons. This is not uh, counting the playoffs or anything. It's based off of the standings. Patriots first seed, Falcons second seed, Steelers third seed, Packers fourth seed. Okay, wait, hold up. I'm restarting. Packer, I mean, Patriots first seed at 13 and three. Falcons at second seed at 12 and four. Third seed Steelers 12 and four. Packers fourth seed 12 and four. Raiders fifth seed 12 and four. Giants sixth seed 11 and five. Seventh seed Titans at 10 and six. Eighth seed Seahawks at 10 and six. 
Ninth seed, Chiefs at 10 and 6. Tenth seed, Saints at 10 and 6. Eleventh seed, Cowboys at 10 and 6. Twelfth seed, Bucks at 9 and 7. Thirteenth seed, Vikings at 9 and 7. Fourteenth seed, Broncos at 9 and 7. Fifteenth seed, uh, Texans at 9 and 7. Sixteenth seed, Chargers at 9 and 7. Seventeenth seed, Panthers at 8 and 8. 18th seed, Eagles at 8 and 8. 19th seed, Bengals at 8 and 8. 20th seed, Ravens at 8 and 8. 21st seed, Cardinals at 8 and 8. 22nd seed, Lions at 7 and 9. Dolphins, 20, uh, 23rd seed, Dolphins at 7 and 9. Colt, 24th seed, Colts at 7 and 9. 25th seed Jags at 6 and 10. 26th seed Redskins at 5 and 11. 27th Rams at 4 and 12. 8th, I mean 28th, 49ers at 3 and 13. 29th Bears at 3 and 13. 30th Browns at 3 and 13. 31st Bills at 2 and 14. And then uh, 32nd Jets. 1 to 15. So all these predictions are mathematically correct. Meaning that uh, by week by week, uh, I gave the team either a win or a loss, and then whoever was playing that team, I gave them a win or a loss. So it's all mathematically correct and everything. But uh, for the overall standings, uh, if there's a tiebreaker, I looked at if the team beat the other team. Or based off of uh, their division, what whatever division was the strongest. So thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe, and don't forget to share the video. Thank you.